Okay, hello, Mr. J here. Good hygiene tip. Good hygiene tip is mouthwash. This is a very thick mouthwash. I have about five or ten of these things. I have I buy I make sure that I take care of my appearance. I do not play. I look good. If I have to be to you know, if I have to be at work by eleven o'clock hell, I get up three hours before that hour. I make sure I'm always prepared. You know, always be prepared when you go but in but we're talking about mouthwash. Sometimes the breath stinks, sometimes you eat too much food, sometimes you you know, you gotta brush your teeth and you put on a this this helps good mouthwash. You put it in it for about ten minutes. It's nasty. It has a, na a nasty mint to it. You know, it's very nasty. I never did like mouthwash, but it does keep your breath smelling good. For example, you might go on a date with a woman. For guys, you go on a date with a woman, and she turns you down, or she doesn't want to kiss you, or she avoids you. Maybe it's you know, it's not because of your looks, or because of your clothes, or because of what your personality. So most of the times, it's because of your, your mouth, your smell, your mouth. You know the, the you know if you if you have bad breath, bad breath is a is a major turn off a woman. That's why they won't kiss you, or they won't you know you know they won't even make love with you if they if you if your breath if your breath smelling pretty funky. If it smells bad, it ain't gonna no. You got to make sure that you brush your teeth every day. Use mouthwash. This thing is very thick, it's thick green, bluish kind of thing. I don't know what it is, but is 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 this thing? It, it works good. It works really good. Just use it. Oh, put it in for about. Two or three minutes, and he spit it out. It's nasty. It, drink some water afterwards, but this thing is really good. Um, this is something you should use when you're going to interview. You cannot go on a job interview and you and your breath stinks. This is for guys and women. This has nothing to do with gender. Just you, you have to, you know, your breath is very important. You can't be in a group having group discussions with people, and then you, you then your breath stinks. You know, they're gonna talk about you. They're gonna, you know, this is why people don't get jobs are because they get fired. You know, you have to have uh, hygiene is not easy. You know, for having good hygiene, you have to make sure that you have you you shave every day. You have to make sure that you comb your hair. You have to make sure that you brush your teeth. You have to make sure that you put on deodorant, lotion, wash your clothes, wash your drawers, your socks, your underwear. Make sure everything's wash your clothes every day when you get home. It's, it's, some people have four have laziness. Some people can't do it. Some people can't. Some people can. Some people have good hygiene. They get promotion. But like I said, having good hygiene. Is is a good way to give you get you that position you want. You want to be a supervisor, manager. Okay, you have to have good hygiene. You know, you can you will never see a, a supervisor or a manager with bad hygiene. You know, but if you want that, you know, um, just just basically a, a, a interview. You can't, you know, you can't go on a job interview and expect the person to hire you if you have bad poor hygiene. You know, um, if you just wearing horrible, you smell. You know, you have bad clothes and you just. Looking like a bum, yo, yo. But any, but besides that, this thing works good. Mouthwash, advanced mouthwash. Gent it, it, you know, it helps prevent gingivitis and stuff like that, and tartar and kills germs, bad breath, like you, gum disease, gingivitis. This thing's help works pretty good. Mr. J here.